My life before Christ, I grew up in a private Catholic school. I went through that my whole entire life from like pre-K all the way till 12th grade in high school. So I knew of God, but I kind of just um, assessed him as like another class to get an A in. So I never had a relationship with him. And because of that, I suffered from extreme anxiety, depression, a lot of self-doubt, and I really wasn't able to fulfill my full potential. So I came to the end of myself and I was kind of doom scrolling on my phone on TikTok and just seeing video after video that was just heartbreaking. And I remember just putting my phone down and just looking up at the ceiling in my bedroom and saying, God, why are you allowing this to happen? Why is this all happening? Why are people suffering and animals suffering? And I heard a voice just like you guys are hearing me right now say, go to church. And ever since then, I just surrendered myself. And then I went to church for the first time and I heard Pastor Scott and his message was, this is is not our best life. We have something so much greater waiting beyond us. I surrendered myself and ever since then Jesus Christ has been my Lord and Savior. So I'm excited to be baptized because this is kind of the last little step. The old Emily is completely dead. The new Emily is here and I just can't wait to continue walking with Christ. So Emily, I'm going to ask, do you profess your faith in Jesus Christ as your Lord? And that you, and he has saved you because of your faith and his amazing grace. Yes. And so because of that profession of faith, it is my honor and privilege to call you my sister and to baptize you in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. So buried with Christ in you. Here's to new life for you, brother.